For this video in the series of Tompkins, Knight & Son, TKNS cookery videos, we've gone a little bit naughty. Ooh la la! We're going to do vision, but we're not just doing one, we're doing two visions. And there's two reasons why there's two visions. There's great elements of eye health within the fruits that we're going to use. The blueberries, for example, we've discussed before, I think, about how um, they have such a massive amount of goodness for the macula, so therefore the retinal health of the eye is incredibly helped by blueberries. But we're also bringing in pineapple. It doesn't have to be these two, we can bring these in. Pineapple is great for the body, it's great for muscle control, it's great for muscle re uh, recovery, etc. And what we're going to do is add them to some sugar, a bit naughty, but hey, we need to do these things sometimes. We can use a bit of olive oil, which can't go wrong. We've got some dairy ice cream, which is gonna come a little bit later. We've got some basil, which is full of vitamin A, and we've got some black salt, just a little garnish, but this whole ingredient together will pull in to make a dish to die for. And there's a secret ingredient, which you'll see in the making later. So. Putting these ingredients together into a dessert is really simple. You just want some butter in the pan because you're going to fry off this fruit. Now not too hot so it's not going to go brown, softening gently. Then some pineapple with the juices, can't go far wrong with the pineapple. Not going to do too much just purely because we're cooking for camera here. And in a second or two we're going to throw some other things in but let's just Gently fry that pineapple, just soften it down, just so it becomes a nice syrupy sort of consistency. But then we're going to add the sugar, because what we want to try and do with the sugar is caramelise it. And so as we caramelise that sugar down, it's going to melt off. And as it melts, it goes brown. We're already using a brown sugar because it's more organically healthy. So what we've done is we've melted down the sugar and if you need to, add a little tiny bit of water, but um, then you add in the blueberries, because they're quite soft. You don't want to do too much with those in terms of frying, because they're going to soften down too much. So you just moisten them in the syrup. But then comes the favourite and fabulous secret ingredient. If you don't feel comfortable doing this, then don't worry. But basically, in there is a little tiny hint of vodka. And the only way to get rid of vodka is to burn it off. So it is fantastically now flaming away. And so there is your flamed flambéed, double vision, because there's two fruits in here, great for the eye and great to eat. But we haven't quite finished yet, and I'm going to finish the dish with another couple of flourishes. So plating up in a couple of seconds. So. Here's a little trick I picked up off a certain famous cookery chef on the television, and I'm not going to uh, lie, this is a, a great thing to do though, because it uses ice cream. Now you can make your own, this is some shop-bought vanilla ice cream, but this is some extra virgin olive oil, and it may seem a little strange to be able to put olive oil, but it's fantastic, Mediterranean diet, brilliant for the eye, lots of goodness in there, and you want a little tiny drizzle over the ice cream. Just strangely, olive oil and ice cream work brilliantly well, particularly if it's a fruity one. And then we can drizzle on the cooked fruits. And what you've got here are the blueberries in the syrup. You've got the pineapple. Um, it's all cooked down in the caramelized sugar. And so we're getting a fantastic sort of sauce to go with the blueberry and the ice cream. And a final finishing touch is one of the most expensive commodities in the world, black salt. You don't have to use this. Any good crystal sea salt will work, but a little tiny black salt onto the ice cream. So having the black salt and the olive oil together, then the other secret ingredient is basil, that whole vitamin A rich uh, herb that seems to go with sweet or savory. So strawberries it's well known for, but now we're putting it with pineapple and there's nothing wrong with a bit of mixture up of fruit. So double vision on a plate, luxury yet healthy.